Hi, Dan, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? Yeah, good, thanks. Yeah, what have you been up to? Not a lot, really. Just busy with work, as usual. How's the decorating going? Uh, we're winning. That's all I can say. <laughs> we're not quite there yet, but we're winning. Well, winning's good. We, uh, we've put the banisters on. We're quite proud of ourselves, actually. We've replaced the banisters. And I've just spent the last, well, couple of months glossing. So you're lucky I'm not wearing lots of gloss. <laughs> Sorry, Donna. Excuse me, just for a minute. So uh, I need to pop to the toilet. Is that okay, right? yeah, yeah, okay, sure. Okay, wait a second. Sorry, Donna. You okay? Oh, now I've got a period from hell at the moment. Bless you. So I'm um, coming and going to the bathroom all the time. You've been to the doctors? Um, no, not for a while. I've had this for a really long time, so I just kind of get on with it because I don't, you know. I don't know. You just you just get on with it, don't you? That's what yeah. we do. Yeah. Somewhere in the, my mid forties, my uh, my body decided to change, and it okay. and uh, I used to have the periods from hell. I wouldn't go out of the house for like a couple of days. Yeah, it was just awful. And um, I went to the doctors eventually, you know, because you, you don't like to, to be honest, because you end up thinking next month it'll be okay, the month after it'll be okay. Mm. And we went on and on like that. Oh, it's just debilitating to say the least. And it came back that I was severely anemic. So that was the answer to a lot of my problem that I was having with the tiredness yeah. and feeling really lethargic. Okay. Oh, I've had iron tablets and everything, but the, the bleeding never stopped. It continued, you know, for months after that. So, so it wasn't connected? It was not connected to it. Well, I was anemic because of the bleeding. Yeah. I felt it put my life on hold. Do you feel...? Yeah, very much so. Being fed up with all of it, I went to the GP armed with a lot of information because I'd found this website called Wear White Again, and uh, from that I was able to, you know, glean a lot of information. And when I went to my GP with this information, we were able to have a good sort of deep conversation about it. For a long time, my life was on hold. I have my life back again. 